find the equation of the line passing through negative 5, negative 2, and perpendicular to 1 third x minus 1 half y equals negative 2. Okay, to do this, the first step would be to find m. And we're going to need to use the keyword perpendicular. The line that we're looking for is actually perpendicular to this given line. So we need the slope of this given line. And so we'll begin by placing this equation in slope-intercept form. Here we could clear the fractions if we multiply both sides by 6. 6 times 1 third x is 2x. And then 6 times negative 1 half y is minus 3y equals negative 12. Now at this point we'll subtract 2x on both sides. That leaves us with negative 3y equals negative 2x minus 12. Next, dividing both sides by negative 3, we have slope-intercept form. y equals 2 thirds x plus 4. Now from this equation, we can see the given slope is 2 thirds. And so the perpendicular slope is going to be the opposite reciprocal. In other words, negative 3 halves. And step 1 is done. Step 2 is to use point-slope form. Given the slope and a point on the line, we can find the equation. In this case, we'll use negative 5 as x1 and negative 2 as y1. Substituting, we then have y minus negative 2 equals m, we decided was negative 3 halves, times x minus negative 5. After you substitute into point-slope form, you then simplify. So in this case, we have y plus 2 equals negative 3 halves times x plus 5. Distributing negative 3 halves leaves us with y plus 2 equals negative 3 halves x minus 15 halves. Finally, subtracting 2 on both sides, we have the equation y equals negative 3 halves x and then negative 15 halves minus 2 is minus 19 halves. Now this is the equation of the line perpendicular to the given line passing through negative 5, negative 2.